Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Portugal versus Canada. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Joao Cancelo starts with Rafael Guerrero as fullbacks. Bernardo Silva plays alongside Ruben Neves in the centre of midfield. And the starting role in attack is handed to Cristiano Ronaldo. And here's the starting lineup for Canada. Well, the 4 4 2 system relies on good combinations all over the pitch. The front two, the central midfield pairing, the fullback and winger, and of course the centre backs. If you can get these combinations right, you'll have a good team. And the game begins. Kyle Larin. Well, it's been a long and winding oh, road. Oh, he's in behind them here, Derek. And just failing to bend the run enough, and the flag has been raised. Clears his lines. Ottavio. Joao Felix. He's in with a chance. Oh, a stellar piece of defending. You know, when Ronaldo is on the pitch, we tend to think he'll stamp his authority on the game, Stuart. What in particular do you expect to see from him this time around? Well, the best players are the ones. Oh, that Stuart, can... they've got to score! And a goal, it was served up on a silver platter for him. Well, here it is again. It's an easy finish in the end, but what was the keeper thinking? That's a poor bit of defending. moving once more how important will that opening goal prove to be Ottavio Felix and it's fallen for Ronaldo and a goal Well, it's great awareness of space in the box. And then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. So 
back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Very timely interception. He's in here. And the flag has gone up. Well, he has to work a lot harder to stay onside there. He didn't read the situation at all. Well, very effective play in possession. Can they convert? He's blocked it! <laughs> and now the delivery. Neves, it should be! Just cleared away in the nick of time. Bruno Fernandes, he's in behind. Well, he stormed through, but it didn't end well for him. Well, in those situations, you have to make a few decisions. Unfortunately, he's made the wrong one. Tejon Buchanan. Wonderful challenge and a throw in coming up. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. And Canada will get the throw in. Tejon Buchanan. Now well, they stopped them in their tracks. Conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Bruno Fernandes! They need to get bodies back. And there is the goal to make it a hat-trick! Excellence in finishing, there for all to see! Well, it's a good finish, as you can see. Look at the bend he puts on the ball. The keeper just can't get across to it. That's an excellent goal. <laughs> on with the action then. And it's looking rather like a matter of how many for Portugal. Jonathan Osorio. And they need to get tighter. Ruben Neves. Could be a chance to break here. A real opening now. Fernandes. He's trying to create something. A goal! performance this four to the good now well here you can see it again good run great strength and a composed finish under pressure that's a top class goal And just look at that score. Oh, what an opportunity. Oh, burying them beneath. 
underneath an avalanche of goals. No let up here. Well, here it is, 1v1 against the keeper, and the outcome was never really in doubt. He never looked like missing that. Goal. My goodness, it's so one-sided. 5-0 in this match. Bernardo Silva. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Well, that is how to play advantage. Now, options are plenty. Now, potential danger. Well, getting in the way, superb save. <laughs> Delivering it, more simple for the keeper. Perfectly positioned to take it away. And threading it forward. And running in behind. Will he? A goal! We're really being spoiled. This is attacking football at its finest. Well, here's the replay, and he shows great awareness to play this through ball. But in the end, it's far too easy to create the 2v1 against the keeper. What were the defenders trying to do? Nice finish, but poor defensively. Well, that's an out-and-out out pasting. 6-0. Number 7, Cristiano Ronaldo. Alfonso Davies. Now with David. Just the challenge that was required. Ottavio. That is that for the first half here. So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. Fernandes getting in there to intercept there's a slide rule pass and they couldn't quite muster a real threat Guerrero Joao Felix being egged on by the crowd. Is this the moment? A goal here! Giving his team precisely what they were looking for. Now he deserves to celebrate it. 
Well, as you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal. And Ronaldo wasn't going to miss this one. From that range, he was always going to score. What a well-constructed goal. Decisive pass. Just needs to stay calm. Ronaldo! Magnificent finishing from one of the world's best. Well, it's great awareness of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. one-sided match. Atiba Hutchinson. Osorio has it. Kyle Larin. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Counter-attacking very much an option. Guerrero. Fernandes, Ronaldo, and there is the goal! He's found the net, joy unconfined! Well, as the replay shows us, Fernandes picks out the pass to beat that defensive line, and this is Ronaldo at his best. He's composed, he shows great technique, and he just smashes it beyond the keeper. And into the last 30 minutes now. Alfonso Davies. Well, great read there to intercept. Well, Portugal had more of the possession, as you can see, and that's been because of their ability to win the ball back so quickly. Their pressing has been... Oh, wait a minute. They could be in here. And a goal by Cristiano Ronaldo. So typical of him. Well, it's a decent goal, but the defenders certainly played their part. Where were they? They were absolutely all over the place. Well, sadly, we have to conclude that this hasn't really been a contest, but all credit to any side committed to scoring goals like this. Buchanan, and with that, the attack fizzles out. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Good bit of pressing. Cristiano Ronaldo. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. And it's fallen for Ronaldo. Oh, yes, a goal. Exactly what they were looking for. And he's come up with it. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And Ronaldo finishes it with so much quality. Just look how much power he hits this with. It's a top-class goal. In 
to the final 20 minutes. Jonathan David. It's with Larin. Very quick thinking there. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Well, it was a foul, but good use of advantage by the referee. Can he make it count? And thumped away. And Bernardo Silva has it. Promising sequence. Chance for Bernardo Silva. And a goal here. Accuracy with the header. Just what they needed. Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. Corner kick played in. Not the best clearance. Neves. And back with Bruno Fernandes. Is it going to be? Ronaldo! Magnificent finishing from one of the world's best. Well, just watch this again. Look how Fernandes beats his man. But really, the goalkeeper should never be exposed that easily. Great team goal, but woeful defending. Goal. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Kyle Larin. Determined defending. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. They might be able to get in now. Ronaldo! Magnificent finishing from one of the world's best. Well, here it is again. The ball over the top is an absolute beauty, and there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. Well, five minutes remaining. But you just feel this is over already. There's a slide rule pass. And there is the goal. He's found the net. Joy unconfined. Well, as we can see here, the pass from João Felix is absolutely perfect and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. So they restart the game and only one team in it. Proper trouble here. And the referee blows for a foul. <laughs> 
throw in for Portugal coming up Otavio it's with Guerrero and teammates around him Bernardo Silva distributing intelligently and a goal Well, as you can see, they finished this really easily. They don't give the keeper a chance, do they? That's a good goal. of scope to be creative in that wide position Ronaldo on a promising looking attack but comes to nothing in the end great strong tackle throw in forthcoming and now it's all over we've witnessed history Portugal have won the World Cup for the first time well, they've been kings of Europe, now they're kings of the world. And I have to say, Derek, they fully deserved it. They were great today. the world champions and this is finally Portugal's time fully deserved best team in the world well you have to give credit to the coach he's been excellent but so too the players and these fans it's absolutely magnificent for them